ever got the place, so um, we ended up rebuilding it in the main room. Yeah, but this was the original bar as it was built. And I believe the dimensions were 24 by 24. And then they started adding on. You see outside towards the patio, and actually in the spring there should be a doorway right here that's going to walk up to the patio. And here, we have the dance floor and the stage. And the cool thing are these old bowling machines, which are functional. One's a dime, one's a quarter. All the money goes towards the repairman that's going to try and keep these things working. <laughs> There's a, this is walking into the new area where the new bar is, which is all covered with stuff that is going to be put away later today. And we have, what is it, 16, 26, 27, so there's approximately 36 seats at the entire bar going down. Okay. Now tell me about the, the, the bar behind it. You say you got that from Wisconsin? The bar, um, yeah, it came from a place in Wisconsin that had closed down. It was built in the late 1920s, the back bar was. And it's kind of cool because all the hinges in it on it are Art Deco and there was like some writing on it. We, we even ended up with a, there was an old beer bottle in this one. I got, got it shipped in. So. Um, getting that thing in here was quite a chore, let alone getting it shipped. <laughs> oh yeah, I can imagine. Because you know, it's uh, like 18 feet wide and it's not light. Um, the front bar, I, everything's been recreated to make it look like it's always been here, and that's it matched up real well with the back. And, um, yeah. Now this is the, the main dining area over here? Yeah, this is the main dining area. Um, I think, you know, more of a dining area and bar area. We'll have booths up here. And you'll still be able to enjoy the view of the lake even if you're sitting up here, which is something new for the place. Okay. And so this is all, all new all new flooring and everything in here? Yep. Uh, 5,000 plus square feet of flooring has gone down in this place. And probably about 250 gallons of leveling compound. Oh, which yeah. Which is probably still not enough. <laughs> The place does have a few mystery spots in it, and you know, it, I guess it just adds to the charm. Yeah. In this area down here, I don't know, will it come out on your camera so you can yeah, see yeah. the water? Yeah. But this dining room has been rebuilt. The windows are larger so that everybody's going to be able to enjoy a view of the lake. This and is. Say, this is this is all new out here, isn't it? Right. And then this bar down here is a continuation of the bar up above. So if people have private parties or something like that that they want to book, we can hold about uh, right around 90 people in this room. Point. That area around this radius right here was built with the, you see the lights that are up above to light up a bay because um, we plan on starting to do Sunday brunch um, down the road and then um, more than likely, you know, special Mother's Day things and Easter oh, okay. and so on special and so forth. Events. So that was built to, you know, help light up the buffet when we built it over there. It's going to open up right away. This the up the main level on mm -hmm. uh, the downstairs, you know, as you kind of get things. Well, the downstairs finished. will be open pretty quick because we've got a, um, you know, we've got a Christmas party that's going to be down there. So, oh, okay. Yeah, you know, and yeah, you know, it's all available to be booked now. And um, I don't know if we're in the phone book, but we do have a phone number here then. Oh, okay. What's the uh, what's the phone number? It's two three one three five nine one 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 one. That's kind of easy to remember. Yeah, three five nine one 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 one. So this room is in its last throes of construction and getting the carpenter stuff cleaned out of it, but you'll have to envision a vacant room, and this one will hold. Uh, also about 90 people, maybe a little bit more than you see them set up. Go ahead. And this also has a great view of the lake, so it's going to be available for parties, weddings, reunions. Private Cubs events. Cub Scout meetings. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good.
And then in the spring, we're going to redo the patio outside, so it's going to have a real good-sized patio that's down below, in addition to the other patio that's up above. But we're going to do a tongue and roof ceiling up in there, and then get a nice uh, uh, railing going around it. And it'll be a, a nice place to hang out in the shade. A great in place the in the summertime, yeah.